Griffin Alpha FPSO arriving on the Griffin Field, towed by an anchor handler with a second anchor handler in attendance. This is a ROV flyby of the subsea assets which are presently installed. The midwater arches are of particular concern during the mooring operation due to their vulnerability. These are the four PCVs, position control vessels, connected to the FPSO, which will be used for controlling the FPSO position during mooring connection. The four PCVs will take the FPSO from outside the mooring pattern and move it in, finally beam on to the center in order to avoid any tow wires crossing the midwater arches after which the anchor handlers will back in and prepare to make connection to the first mooring chain. This is mooring number nine being lowered, we expect. ROV locating the end of the chain, confirming its number, following it down to the design connection depth of 80 meters. That will be followed by the lowering of the non-rotational wire fitted with an ROV hook from the anchor handler. The ROV will move in and grasp the ROV hook, after which it will swim towards the suspended chain to make connection to the end link. ROV manipulator is engaging the ROV hook on the end link. After that, the non-rotational wire is recovered by the anchor handler in order to draw the end of the FPSO mooring chain to deck, where it will be connected into a 300 meter section of 84 mil chain carried on board the anchor handler. Once on deck, a five meter feeder section plus the stopper is removed and set aside. Once the chains are connected into the 300 meter section on both vessels, they will move out in concert to the tri-chains to minimize displacement of the FPSO during the operation. A work chain will be lowered with an ROV hook down to the grommet connected into the end link of the 120 millimeter chain. The ROV will grasp the ROV hook and make connection into the grommet. The anchor handler will then recover on its work chain to draw the tri-chain on board, engage it in the calm fork in order to connect it into the 84 millimeter chain using the H-link connector. This shows the chain fully connected and ready for lowering down and transferring the catenary load to the FPSO. This ROV shot is a fly around to show the fully connected mooring system set up at the design tension of 85 tons. Operation complete.